what's up you guys so i'm editing this video and i keep on saying in this video for 2020 for 2020 just know i'm talking about my goals for this coming year the year 2021 don't listen to the year that i'm saying because i don't know what i'm talking about in this video um all right let's get into it now that they know Ooh. what's up you guys i'm coming to you live in no makeup and this kehlani sweatshirt shout out to leilani Well, my daughter was sleeping in the back, but I just woke her up by talking. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys five big goals that I am reaching. I am claiming it in 2020. And there's people staring at me. I have my camera mounted to my steering wheel, so it looks kind of funny. But this is the life that I chose. This is the life I want to live. I want to be stared at for making my YouTube videos. Fuck it. Okay, I'm going to share with you guys as vulnerable as it may feel. Um, I'm confident that I can attain these things. I'm confident that no matter how big you dream, um, that, you know, the desires that are put on your heart are there for a reason. So go and get them, baby. All right. So my first big goal of 2020 is to move out into my own place. If you don't know, I live with my grandpa and my daughter and we live in his house and it's you know great house i'm really 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 fortunate and thankful for my situation but um it's just time for me to move into that new season you know what i mean i want to have my own space my own place i don't need to do over explaining of that i'm sure a lot of you guys can relate with that especially if you are my age i am only 21 i will be 22 in four days Woo! sagittarius season okay to move out into my own place um obviously with Zoe. So wait on that. I am not tied down to living in the city that I currently live in. I am very adventurous. I'm willing to move wherever really, like literally wherever, if it feels right, if it is right, like I'm there, me and Zoe. Goal number two, it's a, it's a bit of an audacious goal, but that's what we do. We make big audacious goals and we reach for them. So Goal number two of 2020 is to buy a Tesla. I'm in my car. Once again, all the things that I have in place of these things, I am so grateful for. I am so grateful for this car. It's a Toyota and I love it and I'm grateful for it. And I, I, yeah, but um, next move, it's a Tesla for me. I'm not gonna explain why I want one. I just, I, I, I need one, I want one, I'm gonna have one. Goal number three of my five big goals is that Zoe is potty trained. Woo! If you don't know, my daughter is two years old and next year in October, she will be three years old and mommy is ready for her to be potty trained. Like she's, you know, she might be getting there soon, but I foresee that in our future. Um, I have changed many a diaper. I'm a single mom and like the amount of diapers that I have changed is astronomical. So I, I'm ready. I don't need to explain that one anymore. All right, you guys, fourth goal is to be monetized on YouTube. I mean, I absolutely adore making YouTube videos. I love watching YouTube videos. I've had my channel for a really long time, but I have made a commitment to persist this time. And I see YouTube monetization in my future. So if you guys want to help me out with that goal, you could definitely help me out by sharing my videos, subscribing to my channel, liking my videos, commenting, all of that. The, those do Those things do really help content creators to get their videos out there and reach a larger audience which is what we all want right all right you guys and my fifth goal and final goal is kind of a combination of two goals two big goals honestly but um in my mind in my heart they kind of go hand in hand because they have to do with what i have to say and the story that i have to tell and that is to launch my book yes a book and launch my podcast. So um, a few weeks ago, maybe about a month ago now, I made a commitment to write a book, write a book about my life and share my experiences with an intention of serving others through the lessons that I have learned. And so I have been writing every day. Um, some days it feels really shitty and other days I feel like writing. But yeah, I it's a really 
it's very interesting to navigate writing a book, writing a big work for the first time. I just, I don't know anything about it. If you guys write books and you want to help me, let me know. And yes, the podcast. So let me just say that originally the idea for this podcast was birthed by me but I suggested that me and Zoe's dad who is actually incarcerated should make a podcast together and we would podcast I would podcast from home and he would podcast from jail and that was my idea I thought that it was a fantastic idea I still think it is but um it just didn't work out it didn't work out I wasn't committed to the vision right when I suggested it and so I was distracted with other things but ultimately I still really want to start this podcast and I'm going to um I'm I'd be more than happy to have him on the podcast he gets out in January which is cool and once again my podcast is really just going to be you know my my way of speaking to my people I love to be of service to others I believe that my gift is speaking or one of them is speaking and um, ministering to others through my story. I don't like to use the word minister. Um, I, I like to feel that I resonate with others in my real voice, just telling my story. So look out for all of those things. And I am really, really, really excited for this year of 2021. Um, you know, we're just taking better care of ourselves over here. We have a more accurate perception of ourselves this year and moving forward like I didn't always have high self-esteem. I didn't always have confidence in voicing my goals or working towards big goals or voicing big goals, but I'm going for it. We're here. It is December 7th. Oh yeah, that's another thing that I wanted to say. I tried, okay, you guys, like I tried to keep up with Vlogmas and once I got behind one or two days, I started to feel so swamped. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to call this Vlogmas Day 7 and we're going to keep moving forward and I'm not going to keep doing this late upload thing because it's stressing me out. Like the fact that I sit down and I don't have any help to watch my daughter and I put on myself to film edit and upload three videos in order to catch up for vlogmas i rather just get on track feel like i got this and keep moving forward because i can manage one video a day but trying to do three and play catch up and do the late upload thing i don't think that is working out so um thank you guys for sticking with me i hope that you guys are still enjoying the consistent content nonetheless i hope that you guys enjoyed hearing about my goals let me know if you guys have huge goals that you want to share in the comments down below um I want to encourage you that anything that you want to reach for this coming year is still possible if you just believe and know that you can do it because you can if I can do it you can do it all right I love you guys I hope you enjoyed today's video and I will see you guys in my next one don't forget to do all the things subscribe like comment and post notifications if you don't want to miss my next one love you guys bye